What is going on, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. You got here, you got Justin, and it is now time for episode number seven of Descendants of the Sun. Yeah, that's right. Uh, last episode was uh, kind of, I guess, a very big conflict, uh, kind of. The big was, earthquake. Yeah, mid-season conflict. Um, we had, uh, like you said, the big earthquake in Uruk, and now it's like Operation Save. Um, it's going to be interesting now that, like, kind of like both of them are like in the element of kind of like why they do their thing right it's like he's there like she kind of said like he kills and saves but like at the end of the day he's trying to save as many people as he can right and mm -hmm. same thing she's doing so they kind of both can see them accomplishing like why they chose to be what they are and then also kind of like still showing how much they care about each other as well um yeah. And that also goes true for our second couple as well, because, you know, yeah, Day Young, first person to sign up, like when uh, he found out about the Uruk, they remember. She, like, she's there, say less. I need to yeah, go save my queen. They, yeah, so uh, we'll see if they have a talk after and then what happens after that. But yeah, we got to save a bunch of people. Uh, I imagine Richard is still alive, so we got to save him. <laughs> and uh, Rich, Richard was alive. He was like... The yeah, days walking okay. around, but yeah, true. And then also about the people in the town, like Agus and um, yeah, Daniel. what happened to Captain Agus? <laughs> yeah, uh, I imagine they're still alive too because they seem like major supporting characters, but uh, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see what happens in this one. If you have been enjoying Descendants of the Sun, be sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you have not already, and if you want to see the full episodes with us, it's on our Patreon in the description down below. You can see the full episodes as well as other shows and other movies that have not made it to YouTube yet. So, check it out down below if you want, and let's start this episode 7. Checkpoint is the end of the point. The gas is finished. How are you doing there? Ah! There he is. There he is. He's got 100 feet. He's got 100 feet. He's got 100 feet. I need my diamonds. Oh, this poor guy. Dude, this guy is dead. Like, what? He is impaled. I, I don't, like... Yeah. And maybe save the old guy. I don't know how he survived. Bro, that man cares about his diamonds. He's like, all right, we saved them. Yeah, he's gotta... like, we gotta say, I gotta save my diamonds. 그럼 여기 여기 아 여기 잠시 조금 괜찮은 거 아닙니까? The office building. Yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> well, let's go there. That's man. where my shit is. 그러니까 당신은 내가 시키는 no. 대로 재난 지역에서 no, no. 상황 통제권은 구조대 지휘관에게 있습니다. Yeah, no, Captain Perm. Yeah, there goes the finger. <laughs> yeah, but you can tell. Oh, okay. Hey, hey, oh, 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 Yehua also lived too. That's good. Yeah, so they, yeah, every, it seems like most of our main cast live. He's gotta be they gotta be careful putting their hands inside the big thing, you know? I don't wanna get stuck. Oh, bro, brother. Send this, I thought why send this guy here? away. Yeah, why is he here? <laughs> It's got internal bleeding. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh shit. I think it's just yeah. I mean. She like wake your ass up. Literally, what? You <laughs> wake your ass up. I mean, when you don't have the machine, best thing to use is your hands, obviously. So. <laughs> yep. Damn. Yeah, you gotta stop the bleeding. My chopper half an hour. You have to get the chopper. Yeah, there's no way. Okay. Cut him open. Yeah. Oh. Meanwhile. Yep. Yep. Anesthetic. 
You, uh, I know. You gotta calm her down. Yeah, you gotta calm her down. It's not the way to deal with her though. She's already in like a great deal of pain. You're gonna have to figure out something. Yeah, this is uh, this is not the way. Oh, she got. She's, she's pregnant. Pre she's pregnant. Oh, that's why she doesn't want anything in. Pregnant. Okay. Yeah. Baby. Oh. So she's afraid okay. to put anything inside her body. Okay. Yeah. I see. Wait, is it dislocated or is it? Yeah, he's popping Two. it into place. Three. Yep. Yep. Oh. yep. oh, that's yep. a lot of crunchy, crunchy. Yep. Oh, he had to oh. put it back into place. Oh. You fill me in on the situation. Uh, uh, I am soldier. Do, 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 do. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, back back. Back back. Let me ask you a couple of things. I am busy. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm honestly, busy. Yeah, I'm busy. Yeah. Badass. Like, we don't need journalists here. Oh, honestly, the person oh, who's oh, most oh. equipped to talk to him is you, Kibom. Like, you're not, you're you uh. kind of like not busy. Count is I'm not good at English, so. I beg your pardon. He's what? He what? He just no English, English, please. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, then you fuck off. That was like, fuck off. Ow. What? He's moving. I can't. I don't think it is. Yeah, he might be paralyzed. Oh, here we go. The guy impaled. Yeah. I this one I don't. Uh, this know. one I, I don't know about no this. Idea. Oh, can only save. It's one. gonna be save one. Yeah. Oh, I see. Oh. He lifted that up. He, yeah. Okay. okay. The thing will collapse on the other side. Yep. Oh. Yep. Oh. Then the rest of it will collapse. Yep. This is literally rock and hard place. This rock is literally rock and hard place. Yeah. I think you saved the guy who's impaled, right? I think the old one would say save the younger person. I think that's what yeah. you would say. But I don't know which one actually has a higher chance of survival. Oh, brother. Not Why this guy. is he inside? Why is he Why? in here? Take him out. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, he's in the middle of the fight. Get it yourself. Get it yourself. Here's buddy. a shovel. Go dig. Oh, he's gonna save him. He's gonna save him. Yep. Ow. My hero. <laughs> That's my hero. He's bleeding. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Where did he get impaled then? That thing fell right on his back. His, right, his shoulder. shoulder. Okay. Bro, he took that for you. He fucking he... ate that, dude. Yeah, they decided to save him. Wow, okay. Yeah, save him. I, yep, that's what I do. You gotta say it. Please. I promise. I promise. God. <laughs> oh, God. And then we have this going on. Bro, he had blood transfusion. Wow, they have to do the wow. surgery. <laughs> yeah, what oh. the heck? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Bro, bro, we need your blood. You gotta sit down. Sit down. Yeah. She's also nervous too, right? Like, you gotta, yes. gotta save him. Literally, it's just you choose. Yeah. You choose. Yeah, we... 
we react to the problem, right? You do everything you can to save as many people, yeah, as possible. So save one instead of, yeah, save neither, right? You gotta yeah, save given one. Given the whole truth? Just in her medical just, opinion. Just which good one, enough, right? Yeah. Which one has the best chance of survival, right? Mm. And then we'll try to save that one. <laughs> I think it has to be the impaled guy, though. I don't know if he has the best chance of survival, though. Because we don't know how bad the hemorrhaging is, like she said. Like, right. Until you take the shard out. At least with the other guy. Like, he, might he just his lost legs, his legs. But he, he'll be but... able to survive, possibly. Yeah, that's Oh, they saved the impaled yeah, guy. Yeah. It makes sense. Because even Mr. Ko, the older guy, was saying, like, yeah, let's save him, right? I've lived my life. Bro, that's my MVP right there. <laughs> He's my guy. MVP. Yeah. That's my MVP. <laughs> yep, yep. Ah, uh, you did good. You did good, kid. Good, good. If I did well and G1 smiled at me, then I know I like my my job is good, you know. Are you joking? Are you joking? Are you joking? <laughs> Bro, get this man off the bed. Like we, we gotta use these for people who are actually. Oh my god. Garlic? Bro, why are you punching that fist? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Bro, somebody needs to punch this man in the face. Like, what are you Every single show that he's in, someone needs to just deck <laughs> Captain Perm. Food supply? Somebody brought some food? I've brought an from 100%. Now. Perfect. You are the best. We'll buy you drinks for 100 people. Okay, that's fair. Yeah. It's on Sergeant. Oh, no, no, no. Don't throw him. Don't throw him. Don't throw him. That's right. He did receive a pay cut. <laughs> He's like, bitch, boy. Yo, that was nice of her, though. And the mother. Yeah. yeah. Everybody helping each other. That's cool. <laughs> Everyone need, looks like they need a fucking deep tissue massage. I mean... Come on, man. You look into her eyes and what do you, what do you see? Like... No, he signed up first. <laughs> he signed up first. Oh, come on, dude. What? No, that's not true. Yeah, it's true. Okay, okay, there mm. he, he covered mm. clean. Covered clean. Kiss me. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. We've been waiting to do that for the last two days. For the last two days. 내노트북 I guess you're really lonely as a doctor. Is Ali okay? I know he's got to get ready for Squid. Oh, game. he has to give her. She has, she has to give the shoes back. Shoes back, yeah. They helped me a lot. Eighteen deaths, forty-one injured. <laughs> Yeah, she's got that guilt now. Yeah. You did all you could, right? It's, 
She did all she could. She saved as many lives as she could. 이쪽으로 오세요. I need a doctor. Yes, that's the one doc. Ow! That's the one doctor I'll see. 지금 되게 예뻐요. That's a joke. <laughs> Wait, what? 나안 보이잖아요. 아까 봤잖아요. 계속 예쁠 사람이라. Yeah, she's pretty girl, right? Yeah. 진단 말고요. 농담인데. Yeah, see you. That's supposed to be the joke. 되게 보고 싶던데. Oh. 몸도 굴리고. 애도 쓰고. But couldn't forget, right? Doesn't matter. Ding. Damn. One hell of a rescue mission, huh? Yeah. Uh, so now uh, we'll see what the aftermath is, because this was like kind of like saving yes. as many people as we could. And now it's kind of moved past the um, critical point, more into the cleanup point, right? Now we're in this yeah. like, what do we do after? So uh, we kind of see, we, we kind of got to see, sorry, what like like they were doing in their respective fields, right? Like uh, we talked about in the intro, it's just like we saw how uh, Jin was like to her, was just like, hey, like, we're gonna try to save everybody, but we try to do the best we can. And that's why it was like, when she had to make the decision, it's just like, like this is what the job is in, this, in these situations, right? It's not like when you're in the hospital, you're trying to save one person, right? You're in the field, it's like, you have all these people and you have to make, uh, X choice, which will lead to Y, right? Or X, and it leads to Z. So you have to you have to pick, so to speak, right? Um, and uh, she she handled it pretty well, honestly. Like obviously, that was her first time, like in that situation, right? And uh, I mean, I don't know what else you could expect her from her, right? Like mm -hmm. she did everything she could, and yeah, uh, we saw how much it bothered her, like. Obviously, because it's just like not even a day had passed from like the decision she made, and um, she'll probably still remember it. But I think, like she said, she's okay because she, I think, she understands like the situation, right? So, um, yeah, I mean, it like it was it was like interesting to see kind of like how all of them kind of like played a role. We saw each of them do something. Like obviously, her uh, Jin. Day Young, obviously, when he he kind of like did the least, but he was like leading the rescue efforts, and then Private Kiboom. yeah, him too. Like he yeah. got to save somebody from where he was in episode one. Like remember, yeah. like the kid, he's a freaking was... pickpocket. Yeah, who in had episode one, nobody to actually saving a life, and how he was so proud he wanted to tell like his quote unquote big brother now, Day yeah. Young, right? Like that's who that guy is. Um, and then... He's like, wait, he's hurt. I need to go. Let me take yep. this thing out. And then yep. She's like, no. And then also G1 saving somebody there too. Everybody, my MVP, like that's that guy. The older that doc, doctor guy with the name. he he's got the the poon on the on his oh, computer or something. That's true. But so yeah. that's that's your guy. <laughs> well, I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, put that aside and look at everything else. He did. <laughs> my man was like, he was like the most composed like of the doctors. Yes, uh, uh, like he, he, he was he was, he was like, the most clutchest one I'd say. Yeah, getting stuff done, and then you obviously had the man who fixes everything in Daniel operating on a skull, fixing a clock, fixing a <laughs> clock, like, like, do, the... doing everything. Yeah. So he's gonna be probably in the interview next episode because that's who the news crew wants. Um, and uh, the only person we didn't see yet is Agus. We have no idea what the no. heck happened. Well, yeah, we him. don't know what happened to Agus in the after this earthquake. So. I imagine he's plotting something, so we'll see. And then obviously Richard hasn't gotten his diamonds yet, which he wants. So. Oh yeah. Uh, we'll we'll see if that comes into play in the next episode. But yeah, we'll see what happens now. The couples are now together. We'll see like if the rekindling is there, cause that looked like it started to happen, right? So maybe we can commit. But uh, we'll have to see. That's gonna do it for us. Let us know in the comments what you all thought. Don't forget to drop that like down below. Like Harris mentioned in the beginning, we do have a Patreon, so if you are interested in seeing the full-length reaction to this and other shows on our channel, you can check out that link down below. Yeah, anything you want to wrap up? Nope, that is pretty much it. Thank you for watching at Descendants of the Sun with us. Like the video, subscribe, join the Patreon, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.